Hello, this is my first real video about uh, painting and what I actually do for a living. These uh, miniatures are part of the French infantry box set, early war for Flames of War. Client had me do them for him. Hopefully you'll like them. And basically what I did was I used the same Vallejo colors mentioned in the uh, painting article on the uh, Flames of War website. And I, what I do is I paint them all in about a base block color. And then I use a oil wash. Oil wash is basically raw umber and about uh, 51 mineral spirits. It comes out pretty well. If you'd like to take a look at them, I'll be uh, showing some more pictures of uh, this and a little closer up and I'll also be showing the rest of the box set. Well, here's the uh, machine gun platoon. Uh, pretty much the same type of uh, paint job. A little background information about myself. I originally started painting uh, for commissions about 2000. I originally was painting mainly Battletech miniatures. I was really into Battletech, but then again, it just died. I'll discuss a little bit more in a few seconds. Yeah, the market for uh, painted Battletech miniatures really died along with the market for basically Battletech miniatures. It just, there were so many different uh, Battletech miniatures out and couldn't sell them. Oh well. And here's the uh, motor platoon. Here's the heavy artillery that comes with the box set. I'll be uh, showing off the uh, light artillery in a few seconds. I originally got into uh, painting Flames of War because of a friend of mine who suggested that I do so because it's where the money was. And actually he was correct. A lot easier than trying to sell off uh, Baltech and Fantasy miniatures. Here's the uh, light artillery. It's a 75 millimeter, actually pretty powerful for early war, for the Flames of War. And I'll be showing off the company HQ next, and that's about it. HQ section, along with the divisional anti-tank platoon, I almost forgot about that. And there is a uh, quite a few miniatures about. Uh, over 200 different miniatures in this uh, box set and I normally charge about for something this size about three to four hundred dollars to paint it. I was uh, quoting uh, some people online uh, I think it was uh, 550 for the entire box set including the purchase of the box set which is two hundred dollars Normally I charge anywhere from a dollar to two dollars a figure depending on how difficult it is to uh, paint. I also do a lot of uh, flame, not Flames of War, but uh, Malifaux and Privateer Press miniatures. People seem to like them so I do them. Don't do a lot of GW stuff. If you like how the stuff I do if you want to check out my website, it's down below in the uh, comment. Thank you.